Tony D and little Joan in the background, and this is a screenwriter's rant on Model House, a movie with a bunch of hot models in a house. <laughs> smash like and subscribe. Thank you for smash liking and subscribing. Check out my books. Links in the description. Comedy Heart in South Jersey. It's the Pioneers books 1 through 13, available at Amazon.com. Don't forget, Kindle Unlimited is free. The Model House is some kind of house where a bunch of Hot models live for a time while they do Instagram and look super hot. So, uh, already, I'm kind of liking this movie. It gets better, actually. Now, typically, they do these kinds of movies where a bunch of guys show up to the house like this and they start torturing the people and it's kind of... I, I just looked at another trailer and I turned it down. I said, ah, screw this trailer. It's the same old stupid thing. And this one... The guys who bust in have an actual plan. So their plan is they bust in, and instead of killing all the models, what they do is they force them to strip on camera so they can make bank online. Right? So they're basically kind of forcing them into OnlyFans. Now, I, I wouldn't condone that behavior, obviously, but at least it's a better plot, is what I'm saying. Like, for a movie... It, you've got villains with an actual goal here, other than we're just crazy and we're going to kill and torture everybody. <laughs> no, they have an actual plan. Their plan is take these young models, get them to strip online, and make a huge amount of bank. And eventually, the models uh, regain the upper hand, they start fighting their captors, and uh, the new girl has to run for help or something. I think one of the, I think the fat model's in on it. I'm not sure. There's one model who's a little thick. I think she's in on the scam. I think she's jealous of the thin models. That one. That one. I think she's in on it. Um, but, uh, or maybe maybe multiple multiple people are in on it. I don't know. Uh, but they're going to kill a bunch of models. And here, this bit is, hey, make sure you tag me. And then the car comes and, like, hits her. I'm not sure how, what that has to do with the house. But in theaters and on demand, April 5th. Hey, look. That's not a bad premise for a movie. Look, these movies are usually pretty damn lazy. <laughs> it's usually like, oh, a bunch of crazy people take us hostage and they do horrible things. First, you got the models. They're all hot. Fantastic. Even the even the thick one's kind of hot. Um, then you have the, the goons come in and they have an actual plan. So I'm kind of liking this movie. All right, so first act... You got the new hot model with the fro, and she's uh, in, on the shoot, and they invite her to the model house. Oh, I'm staying in the model house. Oh, this is going to be great for your career. Oh, we're a bunch of Instagram models. Oh, it's going to be great. So they're sitting around talking about, you know, girl stuff, and they're dancing and having a good time, I, I assume comparing boobs, um, when eventually, see, see, you thought I was joking. Eventually, crazy people show up. But they're not that crazy. They're out to get money. They're gonna, they're gonna make them. Oh wow! They're even gonna, even gonna do this. Like, oh, please donate to the Bella Baylor Family Foundation. Oh, okay, so it's got a big scam, big scam, money scam. They make them strip, and they get a bunch of money. But it's not enough. They're having trouble getting, getting a lot of donations. Eventually, the girls turn the tables on them, and uh, but things get deadly. It escalates. In the second act, right? So the second act, it's escalating, escalating. Finally, it gets deadly. It becomes game cat and mouse. And in the end, uh, the girls win. And the bad guys are are killed. So, look, I'm not a huge fan of these movies. But this one is different. It has an actual plan for the bad guys. And to me, this has always been the weakness of these movies. When the plan of the bad guys is, well, we're just crazy and we do horrible things to people because we're nuts, that's not a plan. That is lazy writing. It's not interesting. But when you have an actual plan, when these guys actually, they, they want money, why do they want the money? Maybe there's some reason. Maybe it's revenge. Maybe they need the money to get out of the country. There's some other reason. It makes the villains more complicated. Um, and it gives the girls something to fight back other than, oh, they're crazy and they're suicidal and uh, 
uh, the only way we're going to survive is if we kill them all. Like, no, it's, it's a little different than that. There's more nuance here. So I would see this movie. Plus, you got all these hot chicks. I mean, who doesn't love hot chicks? Who doesn't love hot chicks? A lot of hot chick movies coming out. Good job, independent movie makers. Mostly independent guys, not the not the big time Hollywood guys, the, the little time Hollywood guys. All right, let's uh, read the write up here. See, oh, good, there's a write up. Model home or model house follow, follows five swimsuit models shooting a lucrative swimwear campaign at a waterfall 100 miles north of Los Angeles. Perfect. The client has put them up in a secluded house for the weekend, which is referred to in the fashion industry as a model house. Over the course of the first night, the models document nearly every move, including their vulnerable location to their millions of social media followers. Before they know it, two intruders break into the house, held at gunpoint, the girls are forced to take fake donation link to their social media page until a million dollars is stolen from their followers. Soon realizing their lives are at risk, the models take matters into their own hands and fight back. Oh, so maybe the Maybe the bad guys are going to get the million dollars and then kill them all. Hey, that's an interesting... I like it. I like the plot. I don't like the... It's not real life, so calm down. I can't stand it when people start yelling at me because I talk about stuff in a movie and they think I'm talking about real life. Like, we're talking about movie stuff. For a movie thing, that's a good plot. That's a good plot. That's a, that's a cut above these normal house movies. That just, again, are lazy, crazy protagonists, or antagonists, I should say. So good on you. Um, yeah, that's about all the, the, the info we have. Shout Studios, it's a good trailer. And Hot Chicks. Yeah, even the heavy one is hot. So kudos to you. Model House. Thriller movie uh, dropping, what did we say? April 5th. I might go see this. Anyhow... That's it for me, Tony D and Little Joan, somewhere in the background. Thanks for uh, coming out today to um, Granville Place uh, over in Burlington. And then at One More Bar and Grill in Tabernacle New, Taber ugh, Tabernacle, New Jersey on Route 206. Tomorrow, I was supposed to be there again all day, but we're probably going to get rained out. It's about 90% likely I'll be rained out. However, I will be back on Sunday, starting at 11 a.m. till about 3 at One More Bar and Grill for the rest of the Gator weekend. And then at 4 p.m., I'll be at Zed's Brewery in Marlton, New Jersey. So hope to see you there. We'll see you tomorrow.